Greetings, greetings, goddesses, gods. Sorry, uh, this uploads have been all uh, sporadic and neurotic and uh, just crazy. My life has just got more hectic here since I got this little demon dog. But anyway, I've been trying. I've just been recording a lot of stuff, trying to do it. Yeah, getting the uploads is difficult. I've been passing out, sleeping, and just do too much. But I'm getting them up there. Believe me, believe it, believe it or not. Hang on tight. Um, this is just a little something that I've noticed, even growing up. Um, you know, we, we, I've, I have not no saint either, I've done it before, so, you know, I hear a lot of, wow, you're just like your, your so-and-so, right? You're just like this, you're just like that, so, and you keep repeatedly telling the child this, uh, you know, this is the blame game, this is how we all say, this is why we don't take responsibility for anything, because we've grown up believing that we were just like our parents so so we carry that disease with us and you know or whoever uh and you know you know like nothing becomes your fault you know nothing was my fault at all i didn't do nothing wrong because I, I blamed that i'm you know my parents you know you dig like it was all blamed on them i blamed my grandparents i blamed all that because why should i Right? I'm just like them. <laughs> you dig? So, I mean, it took like 40-some years to say, no, I'm not just like anyone that they told me I was. This is where the meaning where they go, you know, uh, you know, like basically discover who you are instead of listening to who they told you that you, that you were. That's basically it, you know, like you're just like this. You know, and, and it's repeated constantly, over and over, you know, and that shit will stick on you, and they're not realizing that they're damaging you, but the real, the, the thing is that you keep repeating that to a child, a growing up child, the first seven years of, it, of a child of the brain's life is very crucial, especially what's going in the brain, and if shit's like that's going in the brain, that's going in the unconscious world. The the, uh, the unknown world, those vibrations and sound and all this other nonsense, language. So, uh, and then it activates when something becomes a problem. You know, uh, you're in school. All of a sudden, you know, you're daydreaming, having a good dream about and dealing with reality. You know, like you're daydreaming through. And next thing you know, you become, you know, inconvenienced to them. You know, now you're blaming, now it's the parents' fault. You know, so it's, I don't know, man, it's fucked up out there. It shouldn't be like that. Everyone, you know, I mean, it took me 40-some years to take responsibility on everything, stop blaming everything on everybody. It was all me. I did everything. And that's the thing. And then, you know, if you think about it, we created that whole world out of our minds, what we were putting in our minds for the first seven years. And then, you know, the teen years, God knows what was going in the minds in the teen years, you know. So, you know, it's tricky. Like, we gotta be careful with how we say shit and really listen to what people say, what people are telling their children, and just anything, you know. And you, you'll you see that people, you know, um, most people, who, most traditional people aren't changing anything. It's hard for them to change. It's hard for them to change beliefs because this is how they grew up, you know, believing that it was someone else's fault. They're not good enough because, you know, there's that wall, you know, so, you know, and this is how we stagnate the mind, you know, we're stagnating the mind because we're stuck there, that's why it's important just to move the mind and still the body, you get the fuck out of there, you don't need to be in there, it's not a place to be, in. you dig, like, it's just no good, so basically, what, what that's called, what that's really called, instead of, you know, some man-made medical term that, you know, man say this is what it is, that, no, it's just this, no, motherfucker, what it is, is we, we, we call this soul theft, this is what soul thieves do, and, but the problem is that these soul thieves don't even realize, they don't even recognize, they don't, they don't even understand that that's what they're doing, is stealing the child's soul, you know, so, we have to be careful, you know, I've got two grandchildren, it were, you know, it's one's three and the other one was just born uh, on Father's Day this year. I mean, we really got to be careful of 
of how we're saying shit. What and that's the problem with the English language is it's it's designed for mind manipulation, and you have to be careful how we use these words, these sounds, because it all reflects back and forth. So I mean, it's fucked up. It's not, you know, it's pretty fucked up. But anyway. Anyway, I don't know. The, the, I, you can't get down about it, you know? There's nothing... You just have to, like, surrender, you know, to this shit and just accept it. And then, you know, if it's in your life, shit changes. We already know that shit will drop off off of you like flies or bounce off of you like, you know, like you're a fucking uh, bouncy ball or some shit, you know? It's like, boom, boom. It's just like... Because we really are in our own worlds, we really are. We really are in your own world. You go out there, you're in the collective world, then you're in the collectivity, you know? And you just tap in the frequencies. It's like trying to find the, uh, um, what do you call it, the station on the radio, you know, or that CD you want to put in there, you know, to listen to or some shit, you know? And that's basically what, what it is. I mean, out there is just a mirror of what's inside. <laughs> All those people, all that shit, none of that shit matters. It's 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 just uh, created in my mind as entertainment. It's just to entertain me. And here I go again with the entertainment because entertainment is a key ingredient to healing. I know nobody probably don't even believe that, but really, it's 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 sort of like mind you mind you mind manipulate yourself into believing to trick the mind, you know. But they can't take it too far because. It'll get, it'll get away from you. That's the thing, man. That's the power of the mind. It'll get a fuck away from you. So they just trick the mind and, and believe in it and shit. And once you start seeing it, you're like, then you're like, holy shit. You dig? Shit's true. So <laughs> all, all, all there is to it, you know, I mean, whatever. But the entertainment part, because you're like feeding, you know, and our brains are, are receiving, our, our minds are receiving this stuff or. We're down. This is like downloading information, like how we download codes and shit. You know, it's the same shit. It's the same shit. And what's going on up there is going on down here. It's the same fucking shit. It's up there is energy. So, you know, then again, we're all in our own worlds. We're all in our own realities. Everyone has their own perception. Therefore, we are in a multi-layered fucking reality. It's just the bottom line, you know. The, the levels of uh, uh, thinking, the levels of thought for each individual, you know, is that's on them, you know. I, I don't really go, oh, this is, you know, okay, yeah, this is the fifth dimension. I don't, I don't even buy that shit no more. Fuck all that. What do you need all that for? That's just, cre you're just creating, am I, am I in the sixth dimension? You know, you're like driving yourself crazy over that shit. You don't need to do that shit. If the, the higher you think, the, the higher you think, the more... Uh, uh, the more enlightened you think, you know, the more observation, the more rational you think, you know, and and forget all the instances, forget all that shit. That shit's not real. Just what, what's real is in here. That's real. You know, and, and we're creating that shit. So, it, you know, it's just, just how do you feel? Not how some institution taught you to feel or educated you to feel. Spirit educates, educates. you know. That's what spirit does as an educator, as a teacher. Not just some person, random person who believed in what some group of people believe and what that group of people believe and who that group of people believe got all this money from, from this corrupt business to fund this so they can just promote only this and only push this certain thing. I don't know. Who knows? I don't know what I'm talking about, really. So, anyway. This is the way it goes, you know? I mean, fuck it. Let it happen. It's not my problem. <laughs> I'm my problem. Me. And once you realize that you are it, you know, it's going to ripple out like a ripple, you know? But once you realize that, then all that shit around you don't matter. All that made-up garbage and that nonsense and this and that and oh my god this oh my god this. where's the mind at is the mind focused on oh, oh, oh or is it focused on only uh you know um solving problems right 
or is it focused only on doing being better right being better from the previous moment thinking better right thinking better is very important thinking better having a uh you know a sense of humor is 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 uh is like the portal to cleansing so it gets rid of this shit you use the imagination to get rid of it. This third eye—they they, they fucked it all up, man. You know what I mean? And that's the secret. That's the secret of it. You know, it's, it's it's all imagination. But we're really living in the imagination. If you really think about it, think about that. Just really think about that. We are really living in the imagination. Think about it. That's the key. <laughs> think about that for a second. Say that again. We are really living in the imagination. So on that happy note, I'll see you guys soon. I'm trying to get these. I got. I don't know when this is gonna get up, little. So, God bless you guys. Thank you guys for hanging out. I love you guys so much. Just, just bear with me for a moment until this gets on a correct course. I know we're still in Mercury, but anyway, I gotta go. So I know the attention span is like five minutes and shit, but whatever. I don't know, whatever. Who cares? Right? I'm sure someone listens to this. I'm sure actually, doctor. There's a doctor. That, that contacts me and uh he says uh, i'm just he, he's overstanding uh some aspects of uh fragment mind the fragmented mind put it that way and he never thought to look at things like this and that level from that perspective an institutional perspective and it's very fucked up. They really indoctrinate shit. <laughs> but hey, that's what it is. That's the way it goes. That's why you have secret societies and, and you know, secret groups and organizations and charities and nonprofit this and this and that and this and that. That's why you have all that shit. Alright, well, I'm out. I love you guys. Follow the fucking unicorn. Be magical and be inspirational. And I'll see you soon. Bye.